Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Mrs. Smith88. Today I have a Yankee Candle Haul. Recently they did a sale and promotion. It ended yesterday. It was two days only where flameless fragrances were $3. So this included the melt cups, the room sprays, as well as the plugins. The only sad thing about it was there was a limit. They only limited it to, to um, 10 that you could buy. I was under limit so that was no big deal to me. I probably wouldn't have been under limit if they would have had a lot of what I was looking for. I was kind of disappointed in my store. I'm going to have a little bit of a rant at the end after I show you what I got. Coupons and then rant. So let's jump in and get started so I can show you guys what I picked up. I picked up a total of six melt cups. And I'm just going to kind of reach into the bag and show you guys. I don't have my hair and makeup done. That's why I'm not on video. So the first one here, this is the Yankee Candle Berry Bliss. And I absolutely love the color of this. I love the purple and that kind of stuff. These were actually already on a table that said that they were already on sale. So technically I shouldn't have had to use my $3 coupon. I'll get more into that in my rant in a minute. But let me go ahead and pull up a scent description for you guys on the Berry Bliss. So the Berry Bliss says that it is a luscious mix of full ripe berries deepened with juicy plum and sweet fig. So I can tell you when I opened this up and when I smell it because I was smelling these this morning before I even started recording. This has a very, very sharp plum note in it. Definitely get the blackberries. Definitely on the darker berry side, but it is a very, very nice fragrance. So I did pick up two of those. I don't know if that's going to be the next one I grab. It's not. So the next one that I grabbed out of my bag is Floral Candy. So Floral Candy looks like that. Let me go ahead and pull up a scent description. I actually hauled this in another video that you guys will be seeing soon from my um, spring candles that I picked up at Walmart. They actually had this at Walmart. And honestly, I would prefer picking this up at Walmart versus Yankee Candle because it's just cheaper. You get six of those cylindrical cubes for like three bucks and that kind of stuff. If you buy these melt cups full price, they are five dollars. So the scent description on Floral Candy is... Colorful blossoms sparkling with sugar crystals and a delicate, 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 I can't speak today. Delicately placed upon delicious creamy frosting. Top notes are sponge sugar, peach nectar, red currant. Mid notes are soft jasmine petals, elderflower, pink honeysuckle. The base notes are sweet violet. Top note is the initial impression of the fragrance. Middle note in the main body of the scent and base and final impression. So then let's see if we can grab the other one. Oh, shocker, shocker. I was actually able to grab one of each scent out. So this one is in Rainbow Shake. I was on the fence with this. And the reason why is it smells a little funky. I will not lie there. Um, definitely look forward to seeing how it does burning. Well, technically melting. Seeing if it smells better. Let me go ahead and pull up the scent description on this one. This one reads, a sophisticated sugar rush, juicy sparkling fruits blended with a sweet vanilla finished with whipped cream, rainbow sprinkles, and a berry drizzle. So basically, it's like a cake had a baby with a berry bliss. It smells kind of similar. Maybe that's why I'm getting a little bit of a weird note. So like I said, I did pick up two of each of those. I'm going to go ahead and move my camera so you guys can see them. So two of each of those, and then I'm going to pull my coupons out of the bag and show you guys what the current promotions are. I did get a kickback coupon as well as a mailer coupon yesterday. Let's get my camera back just a little bit there. Okay, so the coupons that I got. I'm going to start with what I got for when I made my purchase. When I made my purchase, the kickback coupon is this Save $10 Yankee Candle. It says there's nothing, nothing sweeter than celebrating with family. Get ready for Easter. It's just a hop away. And this one starts April 1st and goes through April 21st. And it is $10 off of a $30 purchase. 
These are great if you stack them in conjunction with a sale. Like I seen on the website this morning, select jars were like three for 39. Use the $10 off coupon, you're getting three for 29. That's right under $10 a jar. That's really good pricing. But I definitely wouldn't utilize this with full price items. So now I'm going to show you guys the mailer coupon that I got in the mail yesterday. I like these. I think that they're kind of high end for a coupon because they actually like print them on plastic and they're a little on the fancy side. So the mailer coupon says be together Easter is April 21st. So these go from now through April 21st so I don't have to wait to use these. And this one on the top is save $20 on a $45 purchase. So that's a little bit better than the 10 off 30. The bottom one is even better. It is 50 off of $100. So that's half off your purchase. I told my husband I'm going to try to be good and not buy any candles until semi-annual. But guess what? That's not going to happen. And you know what? He knows it's not going to happen. But he's okay with it. So now I could talk a little bit about my rant. So I went into store because the milk cups were on sale for $3. First and foremost, they were out of so much. And I went the first day. It's not like I went yesterday. I went the first day. And they had no pineapple cilantro. They had no honey, honey lavender gelato. They said they don't carry the pineapple cilantro in store anymore. I asked about the Williamsburg pineapple. They said that's online exclusive as well and it's only in the Williamsburg store. So it's like, what do you guys have? So the only things that I found appealed to me were the three that I showed you, and those were on a display. They had two or three tables set up in the store that said 40% off, and it said this display only. So I grabbed them off that display, I got up to the register, and they weren't ringing 40% off. I asked the lady, I'm like, hey, why aren't these ringing 40% off? She's like, it's 40% off of one item. I said, that's not what your signage says. Your signage says 40% off in big letters and the fine print says this display only. Never did it state one item. She's like, well, it's only one item. And she stood there quiet and she's like, don't you have the coupon anyway for the $3 milk cups? I'm like, yeah, I do. I'm like, but technically I didn't want to waste time pulling it up if they were 40% off. So I had to pull my coupon up. I still got them for three bucks, obviously, which is technically 40% off. Then I asked her about the stuff they didn't have. I'm like, hey, can you place an online order for me? Because in the past, if you go in store, if they don't have something, they will order it for you and they will ship it to your house for free. I've never had any issues where they don't ship it for free. Um, back during the last semi-annual sale, I wanted caramel apple butter cake and it was online. They didn't have it in store. The outlet ordered it for me, had it sent to my house, didn't charge me shipping. I've ordered warmers in the past, back when they used to do the butterfly collections. They would send them to my house and that kind of stuff. This girl did not want to place an order for me. She did not want to give me the 40% off for the sale signs that were posted. So that's kind of my rant that I'm having with Yankee Candle. I reached out to corporate via Facebook message. That was kind of frustrating as well. They're like, oh, well, can we have your contact details? I gave them my contact details. They're like, well, a district manager will be in touch with you. You are corporate. I am messaging you on Facebook because I do not want to invest the time in sitting on the phone. Why can't you tell me why your stores aren't properly stocked? Why your stores aren't following through with sale signs. It's not like the sale price comes out of the girl's paycheck. So a little frustrated there, but you know what? I have been enjoying my Yankee Candle. They have improved on the quality of their products. I do have a Yankee Candle burning now. I technically forgot the name of it. It's the American Home one that I hauled, the like spring blossom whatever. I did do a video review on that and I should have that up soon. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them below.